Hi, I'm Renee McLaughlin, Certified Health Coach and Master TTAP Trainer. You know, as a health coach, I am always looking and searching for the latest and greatest products and techniques and technologies to help us look and feel our best. But what I found is, you know, sometimes some of the ancient techniques can give us the most powerful benefits. So today, I want to share an experience that I'm having right now using something called oil pulling. I know, oil pulling is ancient. It's been used in the Ayurvedic system for I don't know how many thousands of years probably. And it's a system where you use oil. I personally like either sesame oil. I know a lot of people use coconut oil. I use that sometimes too. And you put the oil in your mouth and you swish it through. It's like you... <laughs> Sounds so weird, doesn't it? All through your teeth and the back around and through your gums. And it's very active. You're constantly swishing and pulling this oil through your teeth. Why it's called oil pulling. And you leave it in your mouth anywhere from 10 to 20 minutes. And you just keep doing it, doing it. And it actually changes the consistency of the oil. It gets very kind of frothy in your mouth. But what it's doing is it's going up into the gums and it's pulling out all the bacteria and the um, viruses and the, all just the junk that we've got all up there stored. It has a way that it actually pulls that stuff in. And then after you've done that swish, 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 then you spit it out. We typically recommend that you um, throw it in the toilet because it's very nasty. You never want to swallow it. And so I want to add a little thing that I've recently done that I'm finding to be really helpful. I kind of started to feel very tender. I had some tender and sort of swollen pockets in some of my gums. And that's always really concerning. So I thought, well, you know what? Let me pull back out the oil pulling. But it dawned on me, wouldn't it be cool to also add some of the very specific essential oils that are antibacterial antimicrobial, antifungal, and antiviral, just to add a little oomph to the oil pulling. So what I did was I used some sesame oil, and then, because it's already liquid, unlike your coconut oil, where you kind of have to melt it first. So I used the sesame oil, and then I added three drops of melaleuca and three drops of On Guard, because the On Guard includes antiviral, oils like the um, um, rosemary and thyme, there might be some um, oregano oil in there, and the melaleuca is an antibacterial, antimicrobial, antifungal. So I used that swish, 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 it also tastes a little better than just swishing around the uh, sesame oil, and spit that out. And after that, what I do is I take my toothbrush and I dip it in hydrogen peroxide. And then I start to brush with the hydrogen peroxide so that you can really get rid of all that. And then finished with the brushing of my On Guard toothpaste. It's a toothpaste that um, doTERRA has with the essential oils. And I'm telling you, I've done it twice a day for two days, and those pockets are completely gone. Not only that, but I swear my teeth look brighter and whiter. So I'm going to continue to make this a daily event, just keeping all that clean. Oil pulling doesn't just help with dental health. It helps with a host of other things, and I've listed those on this blog post. So I hope you'll give it a shot. Come back and let me know how it works for you and which oils you used with your oil pulling and what you used them for. Thanks so much. Listen, go out and make it an incredible day. Bye.